I'm Dr. Spandan and uh, I'm one of the speakers for the Fisha conference that is going to be held tomorrow. Uh, osteopathy for me is a very beautiful science where you work with the body and help it to align itself. And even though my background is dentistry, I have found osteopathy to be a very enriching factor in my practice. My paper tomorrow is about the connection between the atlas or the first cervical vertebra and the joint between the base of the skull and the first cervical vertebra and how it reciprocates with the pelvis in a person. So I'm presenting a research-based evidence case study where correction of the joint between the base of the head and the first cervical vertebra, the atlanto occipital joint, how it has helped the person to realign his whole posture. Uh, I, I feel it's a wonderful opportunity because I'm also an alumnus from this university and the kind of skill set we are getting after graduating from this program is it, it just takes our clinical practice to another level altogether. So I believe that for all the medical professionals that exist, it would be um, say an eye opener to come in and understand and learn about the connective tissue fascia that exists in the body. Because for us as students, fascia is something that covers. It is the outer covering structure of different organs and structures in the body. But now it has been proven to be an organ, an organ that has its own intelligence, an organ that performs many more functions other than being a structure that covers something. It, it helps with proprioception, it helps with temperature, helps with defense, immunity, communication, transport, so many things. And this conference tomorrow aligns with the neuroscience research that has been happening in the area of fascia in the past eight to 10 years. And that also forms one of the basic foundation studies of the osteopathic medicine. Because when you're looking at the body as a whole, you also need to understand the enmeshed fabric that holds the whole body together. And that's what fascia is all about. So please come for the conference. We have some amazing speakers coming in. Mine would be a case study with evidence and I feel it is very important to do research and find evidence-based medicine. So the more practitioners we have on board, the better it would be. But for those of you who don't know much about fascia, come on board. You're going to be blown away tomorrow in the conference.